guys, so I'm going to show you guys what I got yesterday at American Girl. It's a really big bag, and no, I did not get a doll. I got three items, all from the summer sale, so let's go ahead and get started. The first item I got from the sale is Courtney's Pleated Shorts. They were originally $12, and I got them for $6. Look like in the package. I wasn't really too interested in a lot of Courtney's stuff. I mean, I do want Courtney eventually. I don't know her stuff's cute I actually like these yeah they just velcro in the front and then of course you get a hanger which is always nice I don't know but yeah I like these they're pretty simple they're shorts they're really pretty blue the pockets are real and I know you guys have probably seen these plenty of times before it's not a new item but the next two items are things that honestly I have been waiting for them to go on sale Kalani's pajamas they were originally $36. I got them for $21. Honestly, I could not see myself paying $36. So when I saw that these were a part of the sale, I was like, yes. I love this so much. I am so excited. I don't know how I feel about the material. I mean, it's fine. It's fine. It's <laughs> one piece. It's got like little cinching at the bottom and on the sleeves. And then it Velcros in the back, of course. A little bonnet. This is really cute. And I wish I could put it on her, but again, my Claudie still has her bow in. But the little bunny slippers. So this little Claudie pamphlet. Picture of Claudie and her bed set. And then she's, of course, wearing the pajamas. Now for the big thing, the reason I have this ginormous bag to begin with. I have wanted this item since it came out last year. Originally $79, and I got it for $63. Covey's Elphaba costume. Oh, Wicked is my favorite Broadway play. Okay, I just want to say that now. When I saw that she had this in her collection, I freaked out. I saw Wicked for the first time on Broadway in 2011. I saw it last year. I love Wicked. Like, I will see it a thousand times and it won't change how much I love this play. But um, here's what it looks like in the box. And then, of course, Covey on the back wearing it. I'm freaking out. Look at this. Oh my gosh. The detail of this is crazy. The detail of this broom is insane. Um, and then it's got like the little handle, of course, so the doll can carry it. This is amazing. Okay, so here's like the skirt. I don't know why I always thought it was one piece, but you guys can see that it's got like the different colors up here, but it's like this top is so pretty. Like I've seen it in the store. I didn't really notice like the quality of this thing. Look how beautiful. And the lace, you're kidding. So here are the boots. These, oh my gosh, now I understand why this outfit costs so much. And then they Velcro in the back and they've got this little heel. The top has little loops on the back so that you can attach the cape. Got it, okay. Oh, this is, oh, this is so nice. Here's the little hat. Oh my gosh. Here's Claudia in her pajamas. This is so cute. At first I wasn't sure how I felt about Claudia in yellow, but the more I'm looking at her, the more I'm literally obsessed kidding this is amazing I literally have no complaints the boots are probably part I don't even know I don't know what my favorite part is hey guys so this is my little trip to American Girl to see the new releases and to also buy stuff from the summer sale so first here we're just walking in but yeah so there was Josefina and Kit and then Kirsten and Addie and then the iconic iconic book a lot of us grew up with I didn't know they made books for the boys so that's pretty cool too um I thought this little display was super cute I really want that orange um the outfit with the orange bag at some point I'll get it but I just thought the little flower setup was really cute I was pointing out the outfit um and then this is some of Claudie's like stuff that was on sale um, I guess I didn't realize that there was another outfit on sale until I'm editing this and I zoomed into the price list. If I had a budgeted for it, I would have gotten her jazz performance outfit because $21 for that outfit is really good. There's me pointing out that they're still trying to sell Gabriella's hair thing. And then this is more of the sale stuff. Isabel's um, room accessories were on sale, which again, I would have gotten if I had a budgeted for it. This is the sales table with more stuff, so like that Welly Wisher set. 
that like fruit smoothie cart is really cute and then a ton of harry potter stuff which i was kind of surprised about footage for this part got corrupted but i really hate that bitty baby outfit i just thought i would include that <laughs> um and then they had McKenna for sale along with her accessories and then some of the world bias stuff and then there's the beautiful josephine on her birthday outfit this birthday setup with the dolls was so cute and I tried my best to cut people out, but, like, the store was so busy, y'all. <laughs> um, but there's Kirsten. So cute. And then I love this. Look at Josefina, like, blindfolding Molly. Here's some of Julie's new stuff. I was zooming into her lunch set because I really wanted that as a kid. Um, and then one of her new outfits I was pointing out. I literally love that little crocheted sweater so much. My mom and I were talking about it because she said she could make my dolls one. Like, are you kidding? And then there's all of Julie's new stuff. And then look how cute this little sleepover thing is. I realized while editing that she was reading Tiger Beat magazine. I loved that as a kid. Um, and then there's more of the historical items. So we went ahead and headed downstairs and they had a cute 4th of July setup with the new outfits. I actually really like the one with the skirt and the tracksuit for the boys. Um, and then we had like a late lunch with Miss Courtney at the cafe. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a big thumbs up. Also make sure to hit that subscribe button so you guys can stay up to date when I post a new video every Friday. Also make sure to follow me on my AGIG, which is always linked down below, so you guys can see pictures of some of my dolls and, of course, this queen right here. Bye, guys!